so for our next quiz we got the 16 personalities uh, Meyer Briggs test. Um, I've done this test, personality test before. I did it once in high school. Uh, I think I was an ISFJ. And then I did it again in my early 20s. I don't remember what I was. So they suggest that you do the Myers Briggs test, I want to say like every decade almost because you do change you grow as a person you're not always the same so it's good to find your ba your your baseline honestly um so what they suggest is that you answer honestly which you shouldn't if you want to really delve deep and try not to choose the neutral option try to choose either you agree or you disagree because I know some people like neutral, neutral, neutral. It's like that's not gonna help you. Be honest with yourself and try not to. There's gonna be instances where you will choose the, the neutral option, but try not to. <laughs> so let's get into it and let me know what your personalities are. Uh, you enjoy vibrant social events with lots of people. <laughs> okay, listen, I don't mind social events, but I want you to leave me alone. But I like being around people, so I'll put like agree a little bit. <laughs> you often spend time exploring unrealistic. No, not really. I, I don't. Travel plans are more likely to look like rough lists of than I detail by two. Yes, I agree. You often think about what you should have said in a play. Yep. <laughs> if your friend is sad about something, your first instinct is to support them emotionally, not try to. Yep. People can rarely, <laughs> what you mean? I am the most sensitive person on this planet? Pisces gang, let's talk. <laughs> you often rely on other people to be the ones to start conversations. Okay, I try to start conversations, but I feel like I'm super awkward, so it's hard for me. Unless like we vibe and we're on that same wavelength, it's hard for me. You have to temporarily put your plans on hold. Oh, if you have to temporarily put your plans on hold, you make sure it is your top priority to get back on track as soon as possible. <laughs> I try, but I get distracted really easy. So I'm <laughs> you rarely worry if you made a good impression on someone. Disagree. I want to make sure that we made a good impression. It would be a challenge for you to spend the whole weekend all by yourself. I live alone. <laughs> so. No, I'll find things. Listen, I'm by myself right now. Look what I'm doing. I'll figure it out. You are more of a detail-oriented person than a... Yeah, I need to know the details. I really do. You're very affectionate. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> you have a careful and methodical... Pro mm. No. <laughs> You are still bothered by mistakes. Yes. At parties and similar events, you can mostly be found further away from the action. Yes. I'm like, I want to be a part of it, but I don't. I'm nosy, but I don't. I don't. I want to know what's going on, but I don't want to be around it. <laughs> you often find it difficult to relate to people who let their emotions... No. That is me. So of course I understand you. When looking for a movie to watch, you spend. Yep, a hundred percent. Can't make it. No, I don't. Like for them, I'm. No, I'm not okay. <laughs> when in a group of people you do not know, you have no pro. Uh -huh, nope. When you sleep, your dreams tend to be bizarre and fantastic. Yeah, I keep having this reoccurring dream. But I have, like, I really have to go to the bathroom. But the bathrooms and the bathrooms, so the bathroom stalls are either preoccupied or disgusting. And then the ones, so I try to find one to use that lets, or the doors open or it's weird. Yeah, I do. I do have weird dreams. Don't judge my toilet dreams. I see you judging me right now. In your opinion, it is sometimes okay to step on others to get a disagree. I think we should all be building each other up. 
There's too much cattiness right now. You are dedicated and focus on your goals. <laughs> I get sidetracked all the time. Like, obviously, this is the year I'm trying to be focused, but I get sidetracked. If you make a mistake, you tend to start doubting yourself, your abilities, or your knowledge. Um, no, I don't doubt myself or my abilities or my knowledge. I just figure out what's going on, and then I overthink it and doubt. When you're on a social event, you rarely try to introduce yourself to new people, and also you talk to yep. I'm trying, guys. I, I'm super friendly, but it takes me a bit, like I told you. Usually lose interest in a Yeah, I kind of do. Sorry, guys. You would never let yourself cry. Huh. <laughs> I cry all the time. You feel more drawn to places with a bustling and busy atmosphere than the more quiet and intimate ones. Um... That's hard for me to say. Uh, I have to think about this because I do like being around people that I know and trust. Um, no, I like more quiet and intimate ones because I'm thinking about the hustle and bustle of the city, even though I do live in a city. Sometimes it, it, it's a little too much. I'm going to put disagree. You like discussing different views and theories on what the world could look like in the future. Um... I do, but I'm also like, let's take it each step of the time, I'm trying to, yeah, baby steps. When it comes to making life ch changing choices, you mostly listen to your heart rather than your head. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm very much hard on my sleeve, girl. <laughs> you cannot imagine yourself dedicating your life to the study of something that you cannot see, touch, or experience. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I have to... Yeah, I have to agree with that. I don't see myself doing something like that. Usually prefer to get your revenge rather than forget. <laughs> Listen. Younger Snowy? Maybe. I, I was petty. I'm still a little petty, but I'm better now. <laughs> But I'd rather, I'd rather forgive. I'm not a revengeful spirit. Like I said, I'm a little petty, but I'm not revengeful. <laughs> you often make decisions on a whim. I have been known to do so. <laughs> so I'll put a little agree. The time you spend by yourself often ends up being more interesting and satisfying than the time you spend with. No, I disagree with that. <laughs> You often put special effort into interpreting the real meaning. Um, no, I don't. You think as a musician I would, but I really don't. You always know exactly what you, absolutely not. You rarely think back on the choices you made and wonder, very, very big disagree there. When in a public place, you usually stick to quieter and less crowded, agree. You tend to focus on present realities rather than future possibilities. Hmm. I'm a bit of both. Like, I do think about my future a lot, but now, as I've gotten older, I've been trying to focus on the present. So I'm gonna say Lickle agree. You often have a hard time understanding other disagree. When starting to work on a project, you prefer to make as many decisions upfront as possible. Agree. <laughs> when you know someone thinks highly of you, you also wonder how long it will be until they become disappointed. I don't. You feel comfortable just walking up to someone and nope. I have to hype myself up. <laughs> you often drift away into daydreams. Yeah, I do. Look after yourself first. Nope. Even when you have planned a particular daily routine, you usually just end up doing what you feel. Yeah. I'm trying to work on that. <laughs> Your mood can change for Yeah, I'm also working on that. <laughs> We're all just a work in progress. We're taking small baby steps as we develop ourselves. <laughs> mm -hmm. You often contemplate the reasons for human existence or the meaning of life. I really don't. 
can often talk about your own feelings and emotions to myself, maybe, not to others. Put a little disagree. Now I've started to because that's part of what I'm doing, but mm. you have got detailed education or career development transition. Nope. Really do. Oh. <laughs> Didn't we just talk about that? Spending time in a dynamic atmosphere with lots of people around quickly makes you feel drained and in no need to get away. Yeah. <laughs> you see yourself as more of a realist than a visionary. Oh! I would say younger Snowy was very much a visionary. Now I'm becoming more of a, re a realist, but I'm still very much... Eh. Yeah, I'm more of a realist and a visionary now. You find it easy to empathize with a person who has gone through something you never have. Yep. I will cry for you. One tear out your eye, I'm bawling. Your personal work style is closer to spontaneous versus... I'm just gonna... <laughs> your emotions can... <laughs> After a long... An exhausting week, a fun party is absolutely not. You frequently find yourself wondering how technology... No, not really. You always consider how your action might affect other people before doing something. Um, I'll do a soft degree there, because I do think about how other people would react. I'm trying not to as much, but... You still honor the commitments you have made even if you have a change of heart. Yep. That's not true. I feel insecure all the time. Oh, I'm gonna get my results. Okay, let's see. It's gonna read me to filth. I-S-F-P. Oh, what's that? I already knew I was introverted. Energy, I'm observant. Yeah, that makes sense. I very much, I'll watch you. <laughs> Feeling, uh-huh, that makes sense. Half perspective. Hmm. I remember the, okay, this trait underpins all other turbulent, hmm, the adventurer. I remember now, so, okay, so, as I mentioned in the beginning, um, in high school, I was an ISFJ, and then early 20s, I was an I N an INF. J, and now I'm an ISFP. So it goes to show you that you grow and develop as you go through life. So just because I was one thing, I've now developed and now I'm a new thing. And then in five, 10 years, I'll be someone completely different, which is amazing. Okay, let's find out about me. No thanks. All right. I wonder what the difference is. Oh. The... <laughs> a lion or a house cat. That's cute. I'll read this later. But let's get back into this. And let me know what your, your little acronym is. I'd love to know what we all are. I change during the course of the day. I wake up and I'm one person and I go to sleep and know for certain I'm somebody else. That's hilarious. So this is probably going to read me to filth, but I like that it shows everything and it goes into detail. Oh, Lana Del Rey, Avril Lavigne. Wow. Ooh. My little adventurers. So now I am an ISFP repping over here. So I'm gonna get to reading this and learn more about myself and get ready to fill. <laughs> so thank you for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed going through the different quizzes um, and learned more about yourself. <laughs>